What's up you guys, Sonic-24 again. Um, uh, first of all, I'd like to say Merry Christmas and Happy New Year's to all of you guys. And, um, um, that's pretty much it. Anyway, this tutorial is pretty much to... This is a follow-up tutorial to my RPG Maker 2003 tutorial on how to make characters transform or switch in battle. Now, um, uh, this is going to be a follow-up because somebody kind of informed me that the tutorial wasn't really good and he was having trouble with multiple characters. And after checking my co current configuration for my RPG and comparing it, I realized I made a few differences. I mean, I made a few, you know, changes to my configuration and it's different. So, I have to update it and, you know, get you guys switched with it so that way you can get yours to work too. So, um, let me get started real quick. Alright, so, I'm assuming that you already have your characters already in the game for, you know, set up and transforming, so, let's see. Oh, dang. Alright, so, in my situation, I have my Sonic characters, so I have Sonic Tails, Knuckles, and Shadow, and I have their super transform. Super Sonic, Super Tails, Knuckles, uh, Super Knuckles, and Super Shadow. So, to get this to work, we're gonna see how we can. We're gonna start here. We're gonna go to skills. And what I created was four different type of skills. They're all the same name, but they're still different in a way. And I'll show you how they're different. So, I named my skill. Make sure that the that they are a switch type. If you want your skill to uh, consume MP then go ahead um, description descri you know give it a name you want I just put transform for the time being sound effect I didn't add any and activation allowed I only allowed it in battle I never try feel but if you want to try that out then go ahead okay to and what you'll need to do is create four switches now right here it says turn on a switch I have my for Nook. this one is for knuckles so I have it as Nook super now what I did is that I went in, created some switches, and I named them all after the character's super skill. Um, super, Sonic Super, Tail Super, Nux Super, and Shadow Super. And this one's not the Nux Super, so we're going to leave that right there. And the other four skills are the same thing. It's just that they named the skills is for somebody else, Sonic Super. This one's for Tail Super, and this one's for Shadow Super. So they're all um, switch type skills. You just gotta make sure you correspond them to the same type of um, s switch. So four switches for each of the skills right there. Next, after you get that set up, go over to common events, and what you'll do is create four more again. I name the common events after the switches. So I got Sonic Super, Shadow Super, Tail Super, and Nux Super. Now for Sonic Super, you know, for either character, what I did is I chose it. I got it set up so I can remove Sonic and then add Super Sonic. For shadow, the same thing. Remove shadow, add shadow, tails, same. T remove tails, add super tails. And for knuckles, remove knuckles and add super knuckles. And that's pretty much it to get them to change in battle. Now, after you've done that, go over to the battle events. Now, if you want your characters to transform into like in one certain event in the game as a final battle, then all you got to do is to start on one page and just, um, I'll explain it to you in a minute. But if you want to, um, have it work in all the other battles in the game such as battle one two three four whatever then you'll have to copy and paste a lot of pages but i'll get to that in a minute so to get this to work what you do is you go to m groups find a battle that you want to start with and what you do is that you will start creating pages for the battle events um i created up to eight of them but four is what you need for the transform to work i'll explain the other four in a minute now what you do is that you'll go to um go to the first page and go to trigger what you'll do is you're, you're going to go over here to the trigger area, click the dotted box, and check the switch. And what you'll do is that you're going to pick one of the switches related to the super, the transform skills that you made for the character. So right here I have a set for, what is it, Sonic Super. So we're going to keep it as that, Sonic Super. And what you'll do is that you'll go down here to the wet area, right click and go to insert. And you're going to go to the call of common events and pick the one that you made related to the character Sonic Super and oops I already got that in there so I didn't have to add that and then you go over to the next page pick the switch again for another character and the sort this common event that you made earlier and next character do the same thing and the same thing it, you don't it only dep the pages that you make depends on how many characters you have in the game that are supposed to transform if you got a lot then you'll have to add a lot of pages so just keep following that now to make them avert, 
you're going to have to take an extra step. Go back to common events. And you'll create four more common events in the game. And what I have are the Sonic Revert, Tails Revert, Knuckles Revert, and Shadow Revert. Now to make them invert, what you do is just vice versa on the, um, the opposite of what you did with the other skills up here. Um, for Sonic Revert, just remove Super Sonic, add regular Sonic. And also add a switch operation to turn the super for the super skill for him off. So when you uh, want to do revert, also remember at the um, switch to turn it off. For tails, do the same thing to you know switch it around and turn off his skill. Knuckles, same thing, turn off his skill. Shadow, same thing, turn off his skill. And after you and after you do that, go back to end groups, create the four more pages, and. What I have it right here, I set the Super Sonic against the Revert command. Now, let me explain that real quick. What you do is you go to Battle Layout. Now, if you have an extra Battle Command for a character, for your Super Character in the game, then you can do this. What I did is that I want this, the Super Characters, Super Sonic, Tails, Knuckles, and Shadow, same thing. And I want the set, and I created a new one, the rate of size, increase it by one. Oop, dang. Oh, there we go. Um... I made one called revert and I just set it set to link to event and what I did is I just added an extra revert command to the characters so they all have an extra revert command so and once they all have a revert command go back to M groups go back to the revert pages now the trigger Sonic gets the revert command all you gotta do is just go down the list hero Sonic uses the revert command and when he uses the revert command it'll go call the common event Sonic revert, and what I'll do is just remove the Super Sonic, and then Sonic can turn off the skill, turn off the switch for the skill, and just repeat the same step for the other characters, and it should work in the game. So pretty much that pretty much covers on how to have multiple characters in the battle transform. I'll probably take that other video down so that way you guys can refer to this one instead of getting mistakes by accident. So pretty much that should cover it, and hopefully you guys get it all working out. Thanks for watching the video. Um, special thanks to K Bakura Productions for pointing out the you know the issue so that we can fix it. And I hope you guys um, you know make good RPGs and everything goes straight. All right, guys, take care. If like I said, if you need any more help, just leave a comment. I'll try to help you out. See you later.